Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only. Coming to you with another episode of Knights of the Old Republic. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, we had just discovered one of the uh, journals that Rukil wanted us to find and uh, gave it to him. He wants us to look for the other journals of his father and grandfather. On top of the fact that now Mission apparently needs our help to get Zalbar, because Zalbar has been captured by slavers, which is not a good place to be, <laughs> honestly. So, uh, we're going to head out uh, the gate and go deal with all of that. So, oh, what? I saw you talking with Rukul. Yeah. He told you his legends about the promised man, didn't he? Yeah. He told you all about his missing apprentice and the other lost explorers, right? Yeah. No. Most people don't believe his stories. They figure he's nothing but an old cook. But I think there might be some truth in what he's saying. Okay. That's why I want to stop him. Why? Why do you want to stop him? For an outcast, I've got things pretty good. The village relies on me to bring in food and supplies. I'm an important man. If it wasn't for Gendar, I'd be running this place. Uh -huh. I get the feeling if it wasn't for Gendar, this place would be a lot worse off than it is. Yeah, Rukul that's true too. Finds his promised land, I'm sunk. People won't need to rely on me anymore. I'll yeah. Just be another nobody like all the rest of the village. You're already a nobody guy. I won't let that happen. You're already a nobody. If I had my way, you'd be a literally nobody because I would obliterate you. Uh, what? That's horrible. How can you be so self-centered? Don't judge me. I will judge I you. a long time ago that if I want to survive down here, I've got to look out for number one. The you can look out for number my sword in your face. Land ...might have found something. They might have found clues or evidence, just like Rukul's apprentice. They yeah, would have that information which is good for in you journals. people. I'll pay you if you bring all three journals to me. The two from the explorers and the one from Rukul's apprentice. It's and good for I your people. The evidence What's wrong with sure you? Nobody ever finds the promised land. I've saved up enough credits for my business here to make it worth your while if you help me. It's not even about the credits at this point. This is to help your people. What is wrong with you? Fuck you. Fuck you. I ain't. Betraying Rukil in the village for you? Don't be a fool. I'm the only Oh, this is the same scummy sort of shit. Don't be a fool. Nothing. He won't be able to come up with any kind of reward. Once That's true, but I don't care. Journals. Just bring them to me, and I'll give you a decent reward. Now, was there something else you needed? Not from you. Fuck off. Yeah, okay, you'll come back and see me if you want a deal. Oh, I can deal a sword to your face. How about that, huh? All right, journal entry added. It's just telling me, oh, hey, there's an option to be a bad bastard if you want to be. Ah, no. That's that's not my play style for this game. Nuh-uh. That's for Fallout. That's for a Fable 3. Not Fallout 3. We ain't gonna do that. Yet. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Maybe. Oh, my party is not with me. Come on, Karth. You are dragging. Yeah. Really? Really? Karth, really? Gods. Damn it, Karth. Mission, what are you doing? Come on. Jesus. Alright. Now I got them all together. Jesus. Alright. Oh! That can't be good. Alright, who's my demo person? Um, oh, let me just clear all of this out. Thank you, asshole truck on the road, for being an asshole. You stupid fuck. Alright. Okay. Um, skills. Skills, demolition. Karth has none. And... Already mission it is. Okay. I can recover this mine, I'm pretty sure. Hey, mission. Sure. You adorable 
little scamp. You are so useful. Oh, hello. Oh, well, fuck me then, I guess. All right, well. There we go. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was close. A skeletal corpse, huh? What's on it? Oh, spike in it. Yes, what's credits. in your mind? Not you. You got it. Dork. I want to talk to you. Alrighty. So we can head down this way. Oh, Gamorian. Is that how you pronounce it? Gamorian? I think it's Gamorian. Honestly, I think it's that. Anywho, let's go after him. Ooh! Ooh, that had to hurt. It's like all my swings in one go. Oh, jeez, I keep pressing the wrong button to switch characters. Oh, remains. Nice. Frag grenade! Fuck yeah. Alright, so, let's, uh, recover this mine. Perfect! Outcast corpse. Would this yes. be one of the, uh, when the outcasts with the journal? Promised Land Journal. Yep. That's one. You activate the droid. Um. My repairs actually decent with my guy. But Ready. let me see. Let me double check. Let's repair on. Your repair's not great. Machine, your repair is not great at all. Um, my repair is great. Karth's repair is meh. So, I'm good. So, I'm sure. the guy that does the repairs. Okay, cool. Um, patrol mode. And should... Ah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. As long as it does stuff on its own. Once it goes out the door. Alrighty. I have a feeling it's not going to deal with much. I think I just killed the only enemy it's going to run into. Or maybe I'm wrong. Oh, hey! Look at that! Okay, well, um, you guys, target these guys. Okay, I should have mission also target them. And I'll just sit here and watch the murder. Like the good leader I am. <laughs> hey, you did it. Good on you, Karth. You also leveled up. Nice. All right. So, you have one point. Put it in treat injury because that's the only thing worthwhile for you. Okay. Um. Where should we put it? Huh? Huh? I don't know. Putting it in sniper shot might be good, but. I think, honestly, putting it into rapid shot is probably a better idea. At least for Karth. You're at five. I'm at five. I'm not going to level up any further. Whoop. Huh? Sure. Let me loot them. Let me do the looting. Got a med pack. Cardio regulator, huh? Alrighty. Oh, wait. Ready. This. Oh, oh. This is one of those old style manual locks. No computer codes or nothing. The sewers is the only place you can see one of these on terrace. You can't use uh -huh. conventional security spikes on these locks. But don't worry. I've come across them before. I've rigged up a little device. I like how they're fighting the in the background. Hey! 
Oh, we found Zalbar! Your sight for sore eyes mission. I'm glad to see you too, Big Z. You didn't think I'd forget about you. Mission and Zalbar, together forever. Aww. <laughs> Who's that with you? These are my new friends, Big Z. Without them, <laughs> killed them all off already and he's just walking away in the middle of the cutscene. <laughs> okay. Don't mention it. I was happy to help. You know the language of my people? That is rare among your species. I'm impressed. You have saved me from a life of servitude and slavery. There is only one way I can ever repay such an act. I will swear a life debt to you. A life debt? You sure about that, Pixie? Think about it carefully. You better be sure about this. I am sure, Mission. This is an issue of great importance to me. Because of our great physical strength, Wookiees are being used as slave labor on our own homeworld. They see us as brutes and animals to be exploited. Over the years, slavers have taken many of my people. We must always be on guard against raids against our villages. When the Gamorreans captured me, I thought I was doomed to a life of servitude. I would have been saved from such a fate, and the only way I can repay that is through a life debt. And realize I mispronounced it again. Screw it, I don't care. This is major. Do you realize what it means? Uh... Let me guess, it means I got a walking carpet following me for the rest of my days. Come on! Whoa! That last one is fucked up. Whoa! No! 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 Some kind of loyalty vow, isn't it? A life debt is the most solemn vow a Wookiee can make. It means he'll stay by your side for the rest of your life. Wherever you go, whatever you do, Zabar will be with you. Like Chewbacca and Han Solo. In the presence of you, I swear... In the presence of you all, I swear my life debt. Forever after I will be by your side, Farron Khan. May my vow be as strong as the roots of the great washer trees of Kashyyyk. Brush here? I don't... That's a thing I don't know if I'm going to be able to pronounce. Ever. Uh, I'm honored to accept this vow. I guess this means you're stuck with me, too. Wherever Big Z Okay. Is, well, that's all right. I almost lost him once. It's not going to happen again. That's fair. Glad to have you aboard, Mission. So, I guess I still owe you one secret path. I read the second one. That was the deal, wasn't it? Yeah. Don't worry. I know a back door into that scum den. Good. The sooner we get there, the better. I better come with you. The Volkers put up a force shield to keep the sewer dwellers out. I'm one of the only non-Volkers on Terrace who can get you past it. I can't remember exactly how to get there, but I know it was somewhere here in the sewers. Okay. Over to the northeast, if I remember right. I just hope the Ranker monster isn't still there. The what? Are you serious? There used to be a Ranker monster that made its nest in that part of the sewers. Pretty much eats anything it can get its claws on. That thing is huge! Yeah, I Luckily, bet! Rankers aren't too bright. Yeah, I was a little. I sneak past it before, so I'm sure we'll figure something out. That is, unless you want to change your mind. That's not really an option. Let's go. Okay then, off we go. Like I said, somewhere to the southeast. Just okay. Look for the force shield, and we'll know we're there. All right. Salbar has joined your party. Remember, you can only have two party members with you at any time. The others will wait for you back at the apartment. Okay. Switching. Sounds good. Okay. Well, um, mission is kind of required to come with us. Karth, I'm sorry. I'm gonna be bringing the big Z. Big Zal, Big Zalbar, along with me. Okay, well, I've leveled up, and that means I'm not going to be using it. Okay, cool. Um, so. Oh, he's not bad either. He's not bad. I mean, he's not great, but, I mean, he's not bad. Okay, now my phone's... Uh, it's Discord. Uh, I should have turned that off. I should have turned that off. Okay. Um, and he's kind of spread all over the place here. Huh. All right, well. Uh, treat injury is not really as much of a must with him, honestly. So let's up him a little bit there. And then once we get it to two points, I'll just zoom the rest of them up along with. Sounds like a good idea to me. And get that repair skill up too. 
or computer use. Hmm. He has a lot of he has a lot of use here. And that sounds bad <laughs> now that I realize what I just said. Uh, he has a lot of usable skills, is what I mean. Alrighty. Okay. Um, let's let's put him into dueling weapons. There we go. Do that, and looks good to me. All right. Um, yeah, let's throw that on him. Why not? And missions vibroblade, huh? Well, working with few resources, Mission Veo turned this basic vibroblade into an exceptional weapon, almost as adaptable as she is. Hmm. It's probably a good thing to have on him then. Wow. Has a two hit of ten. What? Where's that damage? No, that's a plus ten to hit. Oh, wow, alrighty, and I can't equip him with anything other than an implant, if I remember right. Well, an implant and shields, because uh, Wookiees are supposed to be uh, damn near naked, apparently, so uh, there's that. I think I can equip him with gloves, I think I can equip him with gloves, other than that, yeah, that's it. Okay, um... Neural band. Whoops, that was not what I wanted. I wanted to go to me. Equip that. Equip that. And I think we're good. I think we're as good as we're going to get. Okay. Yeah. Ah. I love doing that. <laughs> okay. So, that's broken. All right. Might as well loot the corpses. There's the lootables. Oh, there isn't. And it's locked. Okay, well, fuck me. I guess I'll just grab the weapons. Lock her. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? How's your security? Booyah. Ooh, Pazak card. Salbar's bowcaster. What? And a scope? Oh my... I, I'm sorry. I'm going to put that on you. <laughs> that is so much bast... Bastard. F better. <laughs> Fast. <laughs> that, let me explain what I was trying to say there. <laughs> it's so much faster and better is what I was trying to say. Uh, and then they tried to combine in my brain. And that's what came out. <laughs> <laughs> okay so now that we've gotten that out of the way he has a good gun a very 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 good gun okay so he has a two hit of five which is a little worse honestly it's now a little worse let me see if the pistol does any better nope so missions vibroblade wow that just does more damage and shit. <laughs> I can't equip them with anything, <laughs> anything smaller. Well, anything you know, ranged because he just does better damage with a melee weapon. Wait, what is his stats at? Oh, his strengths at plus five. That makes that makes a lot of sense actually. <laughs> so uh, yeah, no wonder. Okay. Um. Well, then, um, okay, there's a rancor in the sewers. Then we gotta look for Bastila still, and we have one more journal we have to look for. Okay, so all of that's taken care of. I only have one ranged party member, and that is Mission, but that's fine. I gave her the heavy blaster, which is pretty decent. And, uh, yeah, really, the 
The only thing I gotta make sure of is that I don't accidentally use that level yes. on Farron Khan. Because that would be bad. That would be very bad. I, I can't get through that way, so that entire section is just unavailable to me. That's fine, I guess. Okay, well then, fuck me. I'll just deal with this one then. Oh, well, it died. Nice, I guess. Okay. Oh! Oh, Zalbar's here. Okay, well, it took long enough, Zalbar. Oh, geez. Boom. Booyah. Alright, uh-oh. Uh, well, uh, mission, you should probably take care of that yeah. from range before it closes in. Um, sure. There we go. Oh, geez. Okay. Okay. There's a number of them more than I thought there would be. No remains. Okay. Well. Yeah. I guess. You're going to be the one dealing with these. Because you can recover them really easily. Skill too low? Skill too low? I think you're full of shit. Okay, cool. I knew the game was lying to me. I knew it had to be lying to me. Skeletal corpse, okay. Well, since you won't be needing that anymore... Because he's dead. Or she. We don't know. Oh, hello. Okay, well. Okay. Um. Should probably run in and help. Okay. <laughs> wow. That was faster than I thought it would be. I think Zalbar's just blowing through them. Uh blowing through their ability to defend. Which, I mean, hey. I'll take it. Oh, boy. Oh, hello! Hello! How is you? Uh, now dead, apparently, because Zalbar is blowing through your defenses. Holy shit. Wow. Big Z. You are the biggest. The biggest ever. Jeez. My god, that's the greatest. Okay. At this point, I am just exploring. Trying to find things. Oh, hello! Time to run. Okay, well, time to fight. All right, cool. Fair enough. We're doing pretty well. Not bad. Not bad, Big Z. Not bad at all. Oh, did we find the other journal? We found the other journal. Found them all. And we found a skeletal corpse. Okay. So, you found another journal, the Journal of Rukil's Apprentice, and the other journal you have. It looks like you have all the clues to reveal the true location of the Promised Land. Which means we should probably get out of here. But, I'm also in exploration mode. Oh, hello! Hi there! Okay. This is not going well. At least not for me. Not for my body. And my health. Okay. Is there any remains on them? Nope. Does not look like it. Oh, there is a corpse, though. That they were all sitting around. So they should have something. Yeah. Okay. Let's open this up. I assume the ladder is to go up to the lower city? Maybe? I don't know. Let's take the ladder. Let's see where it takes us.
Oh, no. Okay. All right. Uh, time to do a little cheatsy doodle. Which is not really a cheatsy doodle. It's more of a save my assy doodle. Ah, good. Now I'm healed. And now I can take on these monstrosities with relatively little issue. Okay. Oh, that... Hope you get used to that noise every time I load in and out of the place. Oh, boy. Mission is almost dead. This can't be good. Oh, mission might be fine. Mission might be fine after all. Never mind. Never mind. She'll be back. There we go. See? I told you. She's fine. She's all fine. Okay. I was about to say. I'm pretty sure I've been over here and looted that corpse already. But, uh... I have to double check, you know? Especially when new enemies pop out of nowhere. Mission seems rather distant. Hey. hey there. What can I do for you? Uh, you're not looking so good. You're looking a little hurt. Uh, I'd, I'd like to know if you are still hurt. Also, more about you in general. Really? You want to know about me? Nobody's ever really been interested in me before. What do you want to know? Um, how did you two get together? Big Z's my family, you know? Okay. My parents, well, I, I guess they're dead. It was just me on my own until the day I saw Zalbar in the lower city. I could tell right away he was in trouble. Okay. This was before the gang wars were out of hand. But even then, the Volkers were scum. Mm -hmm. A few of them were hassling Big Z, trying to pick a fight, but he wasn't looking for trouble. That's fair. Who'd want to pick a fight with a Wookiee? Hey, nobody said the Volkers were smart, but there That's were true. three of them. So maybe they figured they could handle him. I don't know. Anyway, Fair I don't like the Volkers at the best of times. And when I saw them picking on this poor Wookiee, all alone on a strange planet, overwhelmed by the big city, I just lost it. Fair enough. I screamed enough. out, leave him alone, you core slimes, and Good. charged right at them. Well, one of them saw me coming and slapped me so hard he just about knocked me cold. <laughs> What an approach. What an approach there. <laughs> ah, you're lucky he didn't fry you with a blaster. <laughs> Smacking a kid, those Volkers have no class. Hey, don't treat me like I'm a little girl. I ain't no kid. I'm 14 years old. You are old. still a kid. Those you Volkers shush it. scare me. They're nothing but cowards. I knew how to deal with them. Of course, I never got the chance. Yeah, I guess Zalba didn't like seeing me get smacked around. He let out this howl and yanked that Volker a meter up off the ground Ooh. and held him there by his throat. That would intimidate all the rest of them for sure. Oh, what did the other two Volkers do? The other two screamed and ran off. I bet. I say I blame them. The first time you see an angry Wookiee up close, it isn't a pretty sight. Probably I not. Zalbar was going to rip that punk's arms off and beat him to death with his own fist. <laughs> the Volker was so scared, That's a little overkill. he fainted. Or maybe it was Big Z's breath just knocked him out. Mission! <laughs> Sorry, Zalbar, but I keep telling you to brush those choppers once in a while. Why do you think I won't stand down wind when you're talking? Anyway, I knew those vocals wow. were back with friends. So just I the sick Zalbar burns on off. your friend. Ever since then, we've been a team. We look out for each other, you know? How did Zalbar end up on Taras? He was fleeing some kind of trouble back on Kashik. That's all I know, really. Big Z doesn't like to talk about it. In case you didn't notice, he's the strong, silent type. Right. It doesn't much matter to me, though. I accept him for what he is, not what he was. Me and Zalbar like to live in the present. That's fair. That's fair enough. Uh, how did you survive before you met him? Hey, what's that supposed to mean? You think I can't take care of myself? I've got street smarts. I know how to get by on my own. Uh -huh. In fact, I look out for Zalbar more than he looks out for me, you know? Big Z is a little bit too gullible to make it alone on the mean streets of the lower city. Uh-huh. Right. I mean, I guess. Depends on how long you were alone by yourself, but I mean, okay. Say yeah, so. I suppose you're right. Like I used to tell my brother, fast talk and slick words don't get the job done. Brother? I didn't know you had a brother. My brother's a touchy subject, you know. It just okay. so happens, I don't really feel like talking about him right now. Nothing personal. Let's just get back to the business at hand, okay? All right. That's fair. That's more than fair. Touchy subject with the brother. I get it. I get it. 
probably more than you think. Alright, so let's get out of here. Let's go back to the little village area here and go back to Rukil. And then we'll head back up and get health for our uh, get health for our people. Huh? Oh, pff, I keep hitting things that cause the walking animation to get goofy. Rukil! Welcome back, Upworlder. How goes your quest? Well, you about the that, journals actually. of my father and grandfather. I did. Take them. Can it be true? Is it possible that at long last the dream of my father and grandfather before him will be fulfilled? I I can hardly bear to look. No, oh, you 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 look. Yes. Yes, of course. Now I understand. It all makes sense. Now I see why the promised land has been so hard to find. It is so obvious. Well, now I've done a great thing, Upworlder. A selfless act that will bring great joy to all the people of this village. I must take this to Gendar right away. Alrighty. True kill. What do you want now? Have you more fables of a hidden paradise just waiting for us to find it? You may not think these are fables after you see what I have brought you, Gendar. Look at these journals! Really? What? No, it can't be. Are these real, Rukil? Is this information accurate? I swear to you, everything in these journals is true, Gendar. The Promised Land. I told you I would find it. The entrance is far from here, Rukil. It will take us weeks to get there, perhaps even months. And we will have to cross many Rakul-infested areas. I do not deny the journey will be hard, Gendar. But surely it is better than the miserable life we have here. Wise words, Rukil. Our supplies are high right now. We could leave by nightfall. I will tell the others to prepare for the journey. Thank you once again. Up Yay! Up. We did a good thing. I'll say a final goodbye. For where we are going, I fear you cannot come. That's fair. The journey to the Promised Land is long and arduous. As it would be. That is fair. Uh, maybe I should come with you. I could help you on the journey. No, Upworlder. I cannot ask that. The journey will take many, many weeks. That is Those true. Who make the journey cannot that return. That is true. That was the final secret of the Promised Land. When the colony was created, it was designed so that people could enter willingly, but they could never leave again. This was to ensure secrecy on the project. We Fair must enough. Ways here, Upworlder. Okay. I sense your destiny is yet to be chosen, but the destiny of my people is at the end of the long journey ahead of us. Well, good luck, Rukil. You're gonna need it. Light side! Yay! We did good. I wonder if Igear was brought along. Or if he was just left here because he tried to do the thing. Again? Again! That was fast. Okay, hey, Mission. Hey there. What can I do for you? Uh, I want to talk to you about your brother. I was a little snappish when we last talked. Which was Sorry, like five I minutes ago. I get a little touchy when it comes to Griff. It's Griff, It's kind okay. of embarrassing telling people about him. Okay. Why is it embarrassing? It's complicated. Griff wasn't the most popular guy. He had his faults. But okay. But I still loved him, you know? Sometimes people don't understand. I never knew All my right. parents. My brother always looked out for me. He's the one who brought me here to Tars. I was just a Fair kid, enough. only five. But oh, I jeez. If you could call it that. We were stuffed inside a packing crate in a Starfighter's cargo hold with just enough food and water to make the trip. Not exactly first class, you know? No, not really. Not really first class at all. That's like, you're stowaways at that point. I don't know the whole story. I was pretty young. But my brother owed a lot of money. Oh. There might even have been a few arrest warrants out for him. I don't know. Oh. The only way to get off the planet was to smuggle ourselves out. I mean, I don't want to make it sound like we were criminals. Well, maybe my brother was. Uh, at least See, you're willing to this admit is it. Why I don't like to talk about it. It makes Griff sound worse than he really was. My brother had his problems, but he always looked out for me. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean... You kind of have to stick by your family, at least in that sort of situation. I mean, what kind of problems did he have? He gambled and drank. Oh. And he was always borrowing money for his latest get-rich-quick scheme. Oh. But he had a good heart, you know? He taught uh -huh. me how to survive. 
Okay. How to slice into a computer security system, how to get inside a locked building without the entrance codes, and how to spot a wealthy mark for a quick shell game. That, um... That's borderline criminal for most of those. At least two out of three of those is like borderline criminal. Um. Hey, you don't know what it's like. You need those skills here in the lower city. Griff did right by me. Okay, if you say so. Left. I keep hoping he'll come back someday. He promised me he would. Mm hmm. He doesn't sound like he's big on keeping promises, honestly. Why do you gotta go putting my brother down like that? That's just mean. Besides, it wasn't his idea to leave. He fell in with the okay. crowd. It's all Lena's fault. She's the one who took Lena. him from me. Just batted those long lashes at him and off he went. Oh. Oh, this is an Oni-chan sort of situation, isn't it? Oh, gods. Oh, gods. Oni Chan, I'm not gonna let anyone else have you but me. It's, it's gonna be one of those, isn't it? Oh God. Okay. Uh, who's Lena? I don't want to talk about Griff and Lena. Just the thought of that space tramp space makes my blood Space tramp. Dry. Subjects closed, as far as I'm concerned. Space if there's gonna be any help, tramp. Me, I can't be worrying about my brother running off. Intergalactic skank. So is there something else you need? <laughs> Intergalactic skank. It your way. Yeah, I'm gonna have it my way. Burger King. Okay. Oh shit. All right. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna end the episode today. <laughs> Ooh, that was a note to end it on for sure. Intergalactic skank. I. Right. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and uh, <laughs> intergalactic skank talk about uh, Griff, who is uh, Mission's brother. <laughs> rescuing Zalbar from... The slavers in the sewers, because that was a thing. And also helping Rukil and his people finally move on to the promised land. There was a lot that we did this episode, but... Woo! Intergalactic skank and space tramp is one hell of a note to leave this episode on. For you.